Hello. Kiki. Hello, Kiki. Hornbill Kiki. How old are you, Kiki? Kiki. How old? How old is that? Uh, about eight months. Eight months. Eight oh. months. Can, can I ask you a question? Sure. It's for, this is going for a research, yeah? yeah? It's about the relationship of animals, okay? Yeah. When the visitor comes here, yeah. how do you find um, the interrelationship with like the, the monkeys or the birds? The bird. uh -huh. how, how do you find that um, interaction? Uh, usually too, we have to sing and, sing and shout. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. so easily we have... Uh, so we have a different kind of can, different kind of animal here. So, uh -huh. so how many animals you have here? So we have uh, easily we're going to feed the proboscis monkey, uh -huh. silver leaf monkey, and hornbill. All right. So that's why so we have a different sound to attract. Oh, to attract. Yep. So for the proboscis monkey, usually we're going to. Uh -oh. Okay. So how how do you call the proboscis again? Uh oh. And how about the hornbill? Kiki 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 kiki. <laughs> and for the silver leaf monkey, uh -huh. ew. All right, so they understand that they you yeah. call them. So when they hear our voice, uh -huh. so they will come. All right. So is it did were you trained to do that uh, communication? Ah, uh, sure. All right. Yeah, so have to train. So how about the your your visitor, the the visitor who comes here? How do you, how would you see the reactions when they see your animals? <laughs> They said it's very funny. <laughs> it's very funny. <laughs> funny sound. <laughs> uh -huh. Is there any like people who have uh, difficulties or maybe they have a kind of medical conditions when they see the animals? Do they feel relief? Uh, have you had that experience? Like people who are not well who come here? Yeah. Oh. Have you had that experience? People who are maybe in wheelchair or maybe have difficulty or had stroke, ailments, mental problems, uh, so who, are, who are so stressed? Is there any experience that you have come across? Uh, and they, f how is, how do they feel when they see uh, the animals? So, from my experience, mm -hmm. that I think was, I saw that they become happy. They become happy, <laughs> yeah. Do you think the, the, uh, the animals, um, how do you see your animals when they they see that the the visitor is so happy? We are so happy. <laughs> All right. So you have experience like people who there are people really you can see that they're not happy or maybe have some yeah, sure. uh, mental like, uh, problem. Usually, usually they are old men. Old, old men. people. Yeah. So when they come here, uh -huh. so when he go, when we are. Uh, feed the proboscis monkey. The, mm -hmm. the monkey very close with them. Uh huh. So they are very happy. Okay. Because yeah, especially uh, yeah, they happy because uh, there's no any place that they can uh, feel feel uh, very close with the wild animal. Oh, right. so they're uh -huh. happy, yeah. <laughs> so so you do think that when they have an encounter with the uh, with the proboscis or uh, like this is very close yeah. this is the closest because last time it, when I was working as in tourism yeah. we only watch by yeah. so this is considered a very intimate relationship with the with, with the wild yeah so animal. this is good interaction with uh, with the animal yeah interaction with, with the animal uh -huh. so this is a good, good interaction so you could see that there is really improvement Yep. <laughs> they oh, do they come again? Do they come again? So what? Uh, the 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 clients who are oh some of them maybe twice or thrice. So in here what I, what I see sometimes I have experience about uh, February. Okay. So that one family in the month in the weeks so they come in. Uh huh. Three, three times. Three times. And and also we have, I have a friend uh -huh. from KK. Uh huh. So this uh, my friend Siti, they, they are from Australia. All right. But they are living in the KK. Okay, in Kota Kinabalu. So uh -huh. they try to live, live it, they stay at the Nepal Lodge. Uh huh. And after that they feel 
they are enjoying to stay here and also they are enjoying with our in our sanctuary. Uh, sanctuary so that's uh -huh. why it's not lovely to, to invite his friend from his children to come here. Uh, all right. Uh -huh. I meet I meet uh, this family three times. All oh, right. Okay. So they didn't forget my name. So. <laughs> Jonathan. So your name is Jonathan. Jonathan. Yes. And you work at what's the name? As a uh, in-house guide. In-house guide. Yeah. Okay. So later yeah. also we have a Jonathan also. All right. We have a Jonathan, but proboscis monkey. All right. Okay. So, so this is Jonathan yeah. working uh, as a guide in the Labuk Bay proboscis monkey sanctuary. Oh, it's. So that's how you observe that you, the, the close relationship uh, with the animal. animal. They they feel relief, and you can see people who are stressed. They feel happy. Yeah. So most of them really feel happy. Yeah. So what I saw here, they become happy. Mm -hmm. So they, be, they become they will they will disappointed when there is no monkey. Mm -hmm. So when the monkey is uh, come close with them, mm -hmm. so they become happy. All right. So in here, what I say, what I see, when they first come here, uh -huh. and then they look around, there's no monkey. Uh -huh. There's, there's, there's nothing to see. But uh -huh. when the, when there's silver coming, and the hornbill flying down on the platform, so they become happy. Okay. Uh -huh. It's because they are shared to me, but they share to me uh, uh -huh. like the magic. Because when they come here, there's nothing to see. All right. But sometimes when they come, well, uh -huh. like the uh, like you're in Disney, in Disney World. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so this is a good experience for people um, yeah. having a like um, a distress. So when they come here, they feel yeah. relief, like in a different magical world. Yeah. And then they uh, share to me, um, Labuk Bay, um, thousand, thousand times better better Sepilok. than Sepilok, which better. is the the orang otan oh that's great thank you jonathan i'll uh, put this one um this is actually a research of my friend from the university of sunderland um uh, the research is all about the relationship of the animal companion uh into into the human being the interrelationship how it will help uh, the human being to become well so it's kind of like uh, the healing power of animals. So as you said, it's magical. They feel happy. Yeah. So that's why you have more people coming here. Thank you very much. My nice name is um, Mrs. Remy Smith from the University of Sunderland. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Uh -huh. Bye.